So our friend Sokotoa realized that he was on to something. But in order to make this work, he had to rename some of the pieces and parts on a right triangle. So here are the pieces and parts. The first one is theta. Greek letter theta looks like kind of like the planet Saturn. All right. Theta is the, the angle formed, that's a symbol for an angle, formed by the hypotenuse and horizontal side. Hypotenuse. This is side opposite the ninety degree angle, always the longest side. Opposite. This is side opposite theta, always the vertical side. Now, some of you who have taken trig before. Uh, probably are noticing that I'm doing this a little differently. This is old school trig. And the reason I'm doing it that way is to keep it simple and not turn this into a trig course, all right? Adjacent. That will be the horizontal side. So now, Sokotoa came up with other ratios. Now, we've already talked about sine. Sine is the ratio of the opposite over the hypotenuse, the O side over the H, the O side over the H. Cosine is the ratio of the adjacent side over the hypotenuse, or the A side over the H. Tangent is the ratio of the opposite side over the adjacent side, the O side over the A side. Yes, there are others. Uh, if you've taken trig, there's secant, cosecant, and cotangent. We don't need them. We're not going to bother with them. But those are the big three. Those are going to get us through that course, through the course. Sine, cosine, and tangent. Just know those three. Now, we can state this a lot more simply. Sine, theta, O over H, cosine, theta equals A over H, tangent, theta, O over A. See how this is getting simpler? But here's how I want you to remember them.
remember those and you got everything. So now we can walk them right through. Sine equals opposite over hypotenuse. Cosine. Oh, I'm jumping ahead of myself. Opposite equals sine of theta times the hypotenuse. Hypotenuse equals opposite over the sine of theta. Cosine. Cosine of theta, adjacent over hypotenuse. Adjacent equals cosine theta times hypotenuse. Hypotenuse equals adjacent over cosine theta. Tangent. Opposite over adjacent. Adjacent equals tangent theta. Oops, getting ahead of myself again. Opposite equals tangent theta times adjacent. And adjacent equals opposite over the tangent of theta. And in case you forget which is what, just remember who invented this stuff in the first place. Or first place, our friend Sokotoa. And just look at his name. Sine opposite over hypotenuse. Cosine adjacent over hypotenuse. Tangent opposite over adjacent. Yes, I lied. There never was a Sokotoa. But that's how you remember it. One of my colleagues was uh, doing the same lesson a few years ago, and uh, one of his students raised his hand and said, well, that's not how we learned it in, in school. And my colleague said, well, how did you learn it? And to which the student quickly replied, some old hippie caught a high tripping on acid. Well, if that works for you, then go for it, whatever it takes. All right, we'll pause here and go to the next.